only on wheels in the back. Daytona, 10 laps to go. The reason I'm doing this is because the only art video I've done is that Jason problem. Which it kind of says, is, I don't know if he's Jason if out Steam problem. But if you do, I can just go to their files and delete that. Okay. Okay, well. So you can hear my star radio. AI, I have AI controlling it, places it in. It's in the back of the pack and all that. Okay. Standings, wave on as our pole sitters, not gonna hold on to the lead in the first lap. That top lane, that surprised me. Yesterday, the winner came from top lane. On the R, you can hear Star Radio. There, Jordan. Okay, let's listen to. Okay, never mind. That is Jordan. I thought you could hear it. Okay, so the spotter radio you're hearing is from Casey Kane. It's the bottom lanes, the top lanes are not working at all. Yeah, if you're saying this is Jack's signal or whatever the Daytona tracking is, it's from the workshop. It is Daytona and Earth. Okay, so top lane's kind of holding it still now. It's only in the turn. Sometimes even if they have less cars, they seem to work better. Like right now, see? Top lane's moving back up. Kind of stop. They kind of get to run, but they don't stop and then go again. Let's go back up to the lead. I like the way cars sound in this game. Like for everything. You know, like, after it's free, down, like, update or whatever for different sounds. It's easy. Just have to. So that, if this game did affect that, that would be really bad for a bunch of cars. Okay, top lane's really going now. After getting blown by in the bottom lane, they're gonna take the lead. Is that Brian Scott in the lead? Well, at least I don't think they have ratings for them. He wants from Todd Dega, though. 2016, Chase Ray. I have a chance to do it. And, uh,. 2016, 2018, Daytona 500. Hey, look at that. Look, since no, I can just hit the I or yeah, I button. And this is done my car stall in front of the field and go really slow. Cause that's how it is out like a what is it like one of those actual steering wheel stuff I think. Cause I see people steering wheels very slow on cars. They're all steady and safe for time. I want to get first, I'll hit the I button, Roy Max, his race. Ryan Scott saw the lead, so six laps to go, as he's fourth gear, 182. This track has unrestricted, so it's how they go, which in qualifying get really fast when you're on your own, but your pack still seems to slow you down, actually. Sometimes you'll go back up that high, or up that fast. Okay, so still too wide. Oh, like I said, we thought about going out, leaves it up, stay in. Kurt Busch is at the very back of the pack. Currently the last place. It's Dan Patrick, six seconds off the field. Coming up to five laps to go. Ryan Scott still holds the lead. Case Kane second, Matt Middle third, Elliot Sadler in fourth, Austin Dillon in fifth. And the second lane's kind of falling apart now. This isn't really good for second and back, because they're going to have to make a move, hoping that the car behind them goes with them. I guess they can kind of, and Kane's kind of looking out a little bit. Okay, so that second lane's having cars coming from the back, starting to come up then. Right, Scott's out a little bit higher than anybody else is. He might be going high lane after this turn, I don't know why. 
So as AI just does that, they go other lane for no reason. Well, Aguilar, okay, Ryan Scott. Four laps to go. Let's go do like a. Okay. It's Patrick. I don't have twin cars in the field, so it gets it gets pretty laggy. If I, if I can uh, tease the league run three cars. For some reason, this gets it's obviously the rack is very different. I don't know why I made that. Sound. I don't know if it's gonna be. Okay, is that Brian? I mean, Chris Busher. Yeah, that's Chris Busher coming up on the high lane. There goes the high lane right past Brian Scott. I think he's right hand. And Busher to the lead. And that tied Dylan and Menard. All. But that bottom lane comes back. These cars might dive down. Try to take back or take the lead. And now we're seeing as the cars start diving down. Including in that. He's to his bumper. No, maybe not. Come up two laps to go up to the splat. Elliot. Just want to do for a second. <laughs> I don't know why I keep my hand. I could have started down, but for reason. Okay, Ty Dillon's making the move for the lead. And. Who was in second place? Case Kane's falling back away a lot. But he's still hoping in the high lane. If this is NR2 or one of my only look up here, I'm gonna be careful with my hand, but I'm not gonna screw for this. I don't know. Two laps to go. Tony Stewart slipping a pie. Outside, outside. And now he's on his outside. Not sure if that's a spotter or not. I, I feel like they have the spotters with the driver you're switching to. I'm not sure. Ty Dillon's on way back. And the bottom lane somehow held on for that turn. Even though I had way more cars. Now they're getting blown by Annette. Coming to the lead if one lap to go. Sponsored by who you ever even want to be sponsored by. I don't Okay. Then the ham win. Second place now. He won. He won the real 2016 Daytona 500. It's getting darker out. Lights are on. I think Annette has this. Unless Denny Hamlin's got to make a move and turn. After you see most of our moves made, Elliot's trying. To, there's no way top lane's gonna come in from way back there. It's gonna have to be another car popping up high. Hamlin, Busher making a move. It doesn't look like it will happen. Switching to that manual camera, and it's gonna be. A net. And we have the winner for this video. Michael Annette, which is like currently an Xfinity Series driver, wins the race. With Hamlin in second, Chris Buster in third. Keep going. I could keep going. Blah, blah, blah. That's the end of this video. AI doesn't do burn out in this game. They do have NASCAR rules though. I don't know what game AI does do burn out Like, when you get like man new drivers to fight pit road and stuff like that. I guess, um, what was it called? NASCAR manager, they, they show like a clip of it. Which is the only way you do good at that game if you have, up even if you have the best parts, you have to have your driver be aggressive. Okay, I got a little battery now. I'm gonna probably charge it before I upload this.
all at the same time actually. Let's end this video.